More than 80 COVID patients need intensive care treatment in Ventura County hospitals. That number is down, but still concerning for health officials. Tonight we meet a popular family doctor from Santa Paula who is one of those patients fighting for his life. News Channel reporter Senator De Los Santos shares his story. As Ventura County intensive care units remain at record levels, 83 people still need treatment. One of them is Dr. John Schrock. He's well known in the community as he's taken care of Santa Paula families for nearly 50 years. Dr. Schrock, do you have any idea how you got COVID? I have no idea. We used PPE in the office and I was cautious. Dr. Schrock was still seeing patients just two weeks ago until he was diagnosed with COVID. Every day has been a little worse, even in the hospital. Dr. Schrock, did you get the vaccine? No, it wasn't offered to us. We tried to get it, but could not. It's unclear why he was unable to receive the vaccine. He also declined a ventilator. Even as he struggles to breathe, he has an important message for those who know him and those who don't. COVID is real and COVID is taking lives. My lovely family and God's grace that I am still here today. And I believe that every breath I take is a gift from God. Things got worse on Thursday when his oxygen levels dropped dramatically. Dr. Mark Labor is doing his best to hold back tears and treat his colleague. He was breathing at 50 times a minute and didn't want me to start morphine on him and I had to tell him that we were going to anyway because he looked like he was suffering horribly. His breaths are so shallow, it's not sustainable, they're not effective breaths and it's like he's been running a marathon for two weeks and it's just not doing anything except exhausting him. He said, I love you. I'm not sure if it was to me or to his son, but I told him I loved him back and I just told him it's okay to go to sleep and pass because I don't want to prolong his death anymore. In Santa Paula, Senator De Los Santos reporting.